I'm good. That's what I was trying to prevent because I didn't want you. Hey, I'm Matt from Matt Lane Fitness. Who the hell are you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm Tyler Gillette. What do you do? From American Ninja Warrior. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and we're about to take Matt on an American Ninja Warrior course. So there's a gym in Pensacola. Yeah, he lives. you live super close to it and you didn't even know. It was 10 minutes away. <laughs> yeah. It's got ninja obstacles. It's a ninja gym specifically, which you didn't know existed. And uh, I'm about to show you that it very much exists. So and you will know tomorrow that it very much exists. Oh, your your body feel will it. feel it. I'm going to feel it. Uh, Jenna, you're going to be partaking. What do you think? It's going to be fun, right? You're going you're gonna to jump and... Uh, my, my back hurts. That's my excuse. Yeah, right? <laughs> I just want to put out there that the podcast happened, and then not a week later, we're doing this. Totally random stranger, no idea who you are, but it was a great conversation. Just come spend a night in the house. Um, so he's actually been recording uh, his podcast at our studio at the house with his co-host. Howdy. <laughs> um, and now we're headed to do this ninja stuff. Uh, if you guys want to know where Holden lives, it's right there. Oh yeah, fresh haircut this morning for the video. Shout out to Colt from uh, Pensacola House of Barbers. You excited? Yeah, I can't contain my excitement. I'm the least agile person I've ever met, so. Have you met Nate? I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I can touch my knees. You can touch your knees? <laughs> yeah, toes, are, that's, that's an eventual goal that we'll get to. This is ninja life. Those last, that last the warm Sign the life away. Wow. Yeah. Owner of the gym, how long you been here? Since October. And who are you? Scott Fredrickson, Ninja Life. Is this the only ninja gym in town? It is. So you have an absolute monopoly in Pensacola. <laughs> yes, we do. From <laughs> New Orleans. I, I want to say I've only been here once before to check it out. And just for being here as long as you guys have, you guys have so much more obstacles than a lot of ninja gyms that I have seen, for, mm. especially for the amount of time you've been here. So, yeah, good. Oh, you're probably that. <laughs> this is really cool. This is very similar to the first obstacle on Ninja Warrior. It's they changed it out the previous year, but for many, many, many years, it's the quintuple steps. So this is uh, a very, very close replica. They are farther apart on the show. We can space these apart. Okay. This is a very good starting point okay. for you. For okay. Who's ever done this. Cool. They make it look easier, I would imagine. Like you look at this and you're like. It's it's very impressive, it's very cool. Like, but it like, I don't know. It's it's got that illusion to it, you know. All right, feel good? Yeah. I will show you three different techniques. So technique I did is one step. The other one is three step. Last one is the safest, slowest way. They allow this on the show. Okay. okay. You can grab the back. Okay. So you can do this to make sure you get across. Sure. Those are the three main ways to do it. People do that usually fall. <laughs> <laughs> so, what are you feeling? What do you think? All right, go for it. Speak to me. What you feeling? So, like, I feel like there has to be like this, like, speed to get through it, but there's much more. It's like, all about this momentum. Calm. I think you're trying to push off before you're yeah. on the block. Yeah. This is better. You can absorb and push instead of just like. I feel like you're hitting here and just trying to yeah. like. You're hitting it bent and trying to push. Yeah. Without the absorbing. So what are you feeling? Do you want to space them out a little? Yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. I don't know if I'm being good at it, but yeah. I'm not being afraid to not do one step. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> so a Much tip farther. I, a tip I will give you is where you want to aim on every step. It's okay. here. Okay. Because the closer you are this way, the less you have to jump this way. Yep. Trust it. Yes. Hey. Just so this last time, wow. Super fast. Good, that was a lot better. 
You're doing incredibly well for someone who's coming from lifting weights. It's the first. It's the first. We'll see. It's the no, first but one. I say first that because one. a lot of people that lift weights, especially when we get to the bar stuff, like throwing your body, which might be harder for you. Sure. You're so used to being in static positions, yeah. and a lot of people try to lache, and they're like tight. Uh-huh. You have to learn to be flowy. Okay. The fact that you could one step those with an incline, first try. Good sign. I'll okay. put it that way. Okay. Not saying there's not improvement. Sure. Very good sign. Liquid chalk. <laughs> chalk is your best friend when it comes to ninja, but also your worst enemy because on the show they don't allow it. Ah oh, no. Except for stage three because it stage three is all upper body and it's so intense that's the only stage that doesn't have a time limit on it. So if okay. you can just beat it, you move on. Okay. Um, but that's the only stage they allow they allow chalk. But in gym we train with chalk. Okay. And I would rather you learn technique yeah. before your hands just go, oh, yeah, you know yeah, what yeah. I mean? Like, because you can't hold on anymore. Yeah. So I would chalk it well, if, if you want to chalk. Chalk is life. Yes. So, yeah. Is there an appropriate technique to chalk application for ninja? Because um, powerlifting, it's totally different. Not that I'm a professional powerlifter. Is there a, I didn't know there was a technique for powerlifting. There's not. <laughs> Depends on how strong you are as far as lifting your body weight, you know what I mean? Which I'm not worried for you on that one. So you can either double, you know, double hand it, match grip, and then when you hit that next one, quickly grab that other one. But, you know, for me and probably somebody like you who's used to lifting heavy things, pull back, okay. let go. All right, okay. Pull back, let go. Huh. Pull back. Skip the ring, nice. Pull, keep that other arm straight. Hey. Yep. <laughs> but yeah, lifting your legs up, that would help too. Yep. <laughs> Genius. Actually move on to next is laches. Do you know what the term lache means? I don't. So it's going from one bar to a next by throwing your body through the air. So like letting okay. go of both hands. I've seen you do that. I've seen you do that. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yep. You cheated. Yep. yep. So that was good. That first swing was good. Yeah. I'm not that one good. Are you sure you did? You kick too soon here. So you want to kick right. as your body gets here. Wait. Yep. Kick. Oh, I thought you were saying wait. Kick. Wait. Nope, too early. Okay, alright. Yeah. <laughs> kick. Yep. Wait. Kick. Good. Nope, still too early. <laughs> yes, it was. Kick. Wait, 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 wait. Kick. Yeah. Does that feel better? Yeah. You kicked late on one of these and still were able to grab it. Yeah. I'm gonna take out one of these and we're gonna have to go. Eight feet. Actually, I'm probably gonna move it closer and just do six. So, uh, kick in here. Yeah, right where my body is. Here. All the way up there. All right. So you are figuring it out and it's making me so happy. <laughs> I love it. Keep going. <laughs> yes. Yeah, now I see it. You figured it out. That's, That's cool. cool. That was awesome. That was so fast. Okay. Guess what? I'm gonna push it farther. Alright. Yeah. I'm good. Go I'm good. Yes! <laughs> ah! I'm so excited for you, dude. That's so cool. And now I don't know if that one. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see. Oh, that was the small one, though, yeah, that you knew was going. <laughs> Might want to. Yeah. That <laughs> just so you don't get blown out of stuff. I really don't think I've ever met somebody who's never trained any sort of ninja and got an eight foot lache in the first 30 minutes. That's the same. That's awesome. This is the lache. Lache. But, but how far is this? This is probably about 12 feet. So, from here to here. Yep, that's the goal. Wow. Work well. Gonna start on the short ones. <laughs> Happens all the time on the show. So. so, I place, I do three steps. I go one, two, three, and then I jump. Okay. Lean a little forward. Okay. Let's just keep that chest up. Yes, so much better. Okay. That's <laughs> 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 
That is different. It is different, but that was close. And you kept your chest up. You committed to that one more. Yes. Nice. Nice. Nice job. You can either pull yourself up and over. Yeah? Yeah, I would do that, because that's what you're supposed to get used to doing anyways. Or you can come down that side. I thought that's what you meant, up and over, no? No, I was just saying, if you want, when we get to the big wall, you can get it. Up and over, got it. Yeah, because the buzzer's on top of that wall. Remember when I told you I was going to destroy you today? And you did. <laughs> I didn't mean to make you bleed. Before I cleared and hit the, the eight foot, there was just this sense of like, this is dangerous, this can't happen, but like, immediately, like not to make this about behavior change seriously, but, um, but it, is. It, it is, like it was very much like, no, I'm going to do that. And then standing right there before I hit that, like I was like, mm, but no, I'm going to hit that. So These are Jenna's workout gloves when she used to go to the gym. So great. I don't want to bleed all of their equipment. This is a pull-up bar that you move upwards. Yeah. <laughs> yep. That's exactly it. Yes. Hey. Yes. <laughs> Feel it. Uh -huh. yes. You want to know the best part? Is on the show too. They make us go up and then cross to the other side. Yeah. Take the bar with you. And oh. yes, this is probably this is the easier version, by the way. So I was so like, I was like, all right. I mean, I'll get it. I'll get it. This is my hand. This is the gap. There you go. About a finger length. Um. So is that <laughs> is that what's on the show? It's double. Yeah, that's about what's on the show. Wow. Yep. Want to wow. see a crazy move? Yes. I don't know if I can do it, but I'll try. <laughs> I've, no joke, I've seen people go from like here to like one above that. Wow. They'll just go, ah, and wherever their arms reach, you take it, you carry it across. That is friggin' nuts. All just fluidity. Jesus. This rhythm. You'll see my knees go like this. It's like bicycle. When I move, I do a knee with it to help me get that momentum up. <laughs> you good? <laughs> like that was effortless. <laughs> you got it. Yeah, boom, bicycle knees, you got it. Now this is the mental, as you get higher. <laughs> Somewhere on that top row, you can turn around. Woo! Fingers! Yep, keep it going, don't stop. I don't want to see quitting that. Ah. Come on, come on. You're on the easy part. Come on. Woo! It's not a crazy amount of technique. This is repetition and just hard. Because this is no, holding on to yeah. about the first two links exactly. of your fingers. Yeah. But guess what? You don't have rips there, so I don't want to hear excuses. Again, the technique with this, if you want to keep your arms straight, you can. And it's all about the knees, side to side. Back, front, back, front. Faster is arms bent, and just blaze. Short as hell. Oh, holding on to those is hard. Oh, yeah. Just yeah. holding on to those is hard. Jeez. That's why I'm, I'm increasing difficulty as we go, so you just get an idea. Yes. And that's the cliffhanger. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Oh, there you go. There's those shoes you were talking about. I'm telling you, it makes a... I kid you not, I've had people that can't get up a warped wall, and it just looks like they just don't know how to do it. Yeah. I give them my shoes, and I can do it for a shot. Shoes are key. Yeah. Because I can, like, this, this is just because of the shoes. That's that's how grippy these shoes are. Flying son of a bitch, because it's the shoes. Again, that, that's shoes. I'm, I'm, I'm not joking. That is the importance of grip on these shoes. <laughs> we represent them enough on the show, you know? Nice. How are you feeling so far? I'm gonna take a break and then uh, try to pop out a course here. If we have time. Screw a break, let's do it. Okay. So, right now, with everything that's happening, like gym equipment is impossible to find. So, where in the world do you go to buy any of this? So, the holds, like all the hard plastic stuff, um, red and black, 
is bought from Monstro, Atomic, Stronghold has stuff. Um, anything else, wood or silver, uh, metal, I made. I fabricated really? and built everything, yeah. That's really cool. We're going to do a little bit of a course run through, kind of compare times, and just kind of see where we're at because a big part of American Ninja Warrior is not just doing the obstacles, but doing them back to back, which makes it a thousand times harder. And this is your first day doing this, and you're already impressing me, so I'm just going to push you. Um, and uh, see how your fingers hold up. Let's do it! <laughs> Let's do it! For time, guys. <laughs> Almost killed myself over there trying to go too fast. Yeah. Um, I will complete it. That's all I want to hear. I will complete <laughs> it. Woo! Failed. 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 Keep going. <laughs> You think these gloves would help me? Smoked. <laughs> God. Forearms are absolutely smoked. I know. <laughs> They're smoked. That guy got nothing. <laughs> Alright, come on, yeah. Connor, we'll finish it, finish it. Try to get a good launch and then go as far as you can. Hold it! <sighs> Alright, focus. Last obstacle, one and clear. Ah! 
time. Ah. What's the time on that? Yeah, like 14 minutes. <laughs> How long? Nailed it. <laughs> I'm impressed. That, uh, just like, there's just nothing left here. Yep. Nothing left. I had no doubt that it was probably incredibly difficult. I mean, the people that are on that show are obviously there for a reason. Anything unbelievably difficult, it takes great people to do. And you become great through practicing, through consistency, through getting your ass kicked. And this kicked my absolute ass. Um, but it was a lot of fun. A whole lot of fun. Was. We're like halfway through, come on. Let's do it. I am completely smoked. Like, forearms are gone. Like, I just upper body in general, smoked. I feel it in my lower body, but like, and I, I did not doubt it for a second, but extremely. It's still an eye opening a little bit. Oh you know? my lord, absolutely. You know it's hard, but till you do it, you don't know exactly how hard or exactly how it feels. Yeah. So, yeah. And then hopefully one day you can um, destroy me in lifting and we'll reverse worlds. Cause I guarantee I'll be just as exhausted as you in different <laughs> We'll see, we will see. Thank you both for being camera crew, appreciate it. Yeah, it was a lot of hard work, but I made it through. I was here. Ninja Life in Pensacola, it's uh, the only gym, so we built it for the kids and the adults, as you can see now. I mean, they're, uh, they're mounding. The adults are here just as much as the uh, kids are. Check us out, Facebook page, got a lot of stuff going on. You don't have to be perfect at this Ninja Warrior thing. Just try to be better than yesterday. Every day? I was trying to mouth it but while you said it. I was too tired to talk. I could finish it. I was waiting for you to say it. I was going to mouth it. I was too tired to talk, Tyler. I'm finished. I'm Better finished. than yesterday. Every day. We'll see you guys next time. What did he say? What the ninja said. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God.